The blocks I'm going to use now are quite special. Each edge is one centimetre long. So this means each block is one cubic centimetre, which is a standard unit that we use to measure how much space an object occupies or the volume of an object. We need a standard unit because a standard unit is one size and it enables us to accurately find the volume of objects and construct objects that have the same volume as each other. Now I'll build two towers using the cubic centimetre blocks. Each tower will have a base of four blocks. Now we can put another layer on top of each tower. Four for this tower and four for that one. There are still some blocks left, so we'll put another layer on each tower. Look at the towers. Do they look the same to you? They look the same to me. Let's check. There are four blocks on the bottom layer, four on the next, and four on the top of this tower. So this first tower has 12 blocks. And the second tower also has four blocks on each of its layers. So we've used 12 in this tower also. We've used 12 cubes to build each of our towers and because the cubes are a standard size, we know that both towers take up the same amount of space. Can you remember what was special about the blocks I have just used? Yes. Each of their sides measures one centimetre and their volume is one centimetre cubed. If we know each block is one cubic centimetre and each tower has 12 blocks, what do you think the volume of each tower is? We can say that each of our towers has a volume of 12 cubic centimetres because each block in the tower is one cubic centimetre.